when you ask people in business or in politics or in general life, what do you care about the most, that they almost never say money. They're worried about money, but they really talk about happiness. And so if we want to talk about the most important things, we need to study that subject as well. It's something that people in business can pay a lot of attention to, I think, quite profitably. <laughs> now, one of the questions that people often ask is, how much of my happiness can I actually control? The answer is, not very much. Uh, now, that's actually not a depressing thing. There's a, there's a lot of research that shows about half of our happiness is genetic and about another 40% comes from the circumstances in our lives. And the remaining 10 or 12% that we have does depend on our decisions. So the question then becomes, how, what are the decisions that you should make in your life that are going to give you the best shot at having a good life well lived, to having a mo the most satisfying life possible? The good news is there's a lot of research on this subject and the research is pretty clear that there are four things that we need to pay attention to. Faith, family, friends, and work. And if we have a balance between these things and we're thinking very consciously about cultivating these four forces in our lives, that gives us the best shot at using the 12% of happiness at our disposal to its maximum effect. Work is a, is a beautiful, it's a good thing. It's one of the secrets to a happy life. When I talk about success, I always say earned success because it has to be distinguished from unearned success. Uh, so for example, winning the lottery is not earned success. Why does that matter? Because winning the lottery doesn't bring any happiness. There are many studies that show that when you don't earn what you have, it gives you no satisfaction. Earning your success is fundamental to a good life.